Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra, this is unexpected. Hello guys, I hope you are all doing great. We are back. The Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra has been a hot topic since the very first day the rumors started to spread. Since then, Tech Chat has shared a lot of rumors and confirmed news about the device with you guys. The latest update about the device is that the Galaxy S22 is going to have the fastest RAM ever in a smartphone. If Samsung's newest memory technology is used, the Galaxy S22 might be a cutting-edge phone on the inside. Samsung's new RAM, LPDDR5 XD RAM, has been developed by Samsung, and it promises significant improvements in performance and power efficiency. Therefore, it could be a powerful phone if it makes it into the Galaxy S22. LPDDR5X stands for Low Power Double Data Rate 5X and it is a cutting-edge new type of memory. LPDDR5 is the most common form of memory in smartphones sold this year, and it's already fairly fast. As a result, Samsung claims that LPDDR5X, which uses 20% less power than LPDDR5, can process data at 1.3 times the speed of LPDDR5. Not only in smartphones, Samsung's LPDDR5X RAM may also be used for 5G, metaverse, AI, servers, and automobiles, among other things. Later this year, Samsung expects to begin producing these RAM modules alongside its manufacturing partners. There's a chance that LPDDR5X RAM won't be ready for the Galaxy S22's debut in February 2022 as originally planned. We will have to wait until the Galaxy S23, or whatever Samsung calls it the following year, or for a different 2022 flagship like the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4, or perhaps a different phone from outside Samsung's stable before LPDDR5X is put to use. Not only that, there is another leak suggesting that Samsung will equip all Galaxy S22 models with a Qualcomm chip, which implies they are saying goodbye to Exynos chips for S22 models. According to a former South Korean employee of Samsung's Super Router, Samsung has recently decided to forego the integration of the Exynos 2200 SoC into the Galaxy S22 series. In all territories including Europe and Asia, Samsung S22 models will include a Qualcomm Snapdragon SoC CPU. It is possible that this information is true, despite the fact that there is no way to verify the news. After all it has been going on for a long time. Rumors the tour in which the Samsung Exynos 2200 will be used on fewer continents than initially planned. In the meantime Samsung appears to have abandoned the Exynos 2200 for the Galaxy S22 series because of the problems, and many will be let down by this. The Samsung SoC has not yet been formally unveiled, but Samsung has previously stated that it would be the first chipset with an AMD RDNA 2 graphics processor and ray tracing technology. It's a good sign that the first standard test results are encouraging. It appears that there are a limited number of chips to choose from, however, now I know the question that all of you guys have. When will the S22 be released? Well, I have the answer to that. According to recent South Korean leaks, Samsung had planned to hold an unpacking event on Tuesday, February 8, 2022. Just like last year, the pre-order period will begin immediately after the official submission. Well, a few more months to go. Samsung fans, what do you guys think? Do you think that the S22 Ultra is worth purchasing? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.